Hey, what's up, everybody? This is me with my other friend, Lucky. Uh, little do some of you guys know, uh, I have three dogs, not just one. Uh, you guys are used to seeing Chauncey, but Lucky is actually otherwise known in my house as my snuggle buddy. Otherwise, it's been a pretty messy hair, don't care kind of day. Uh, it's Monday after the 4th of July, and we did nothing. Uh, except listen to uh, random fireworks going off illegally. That was about it. But uh, weekend was nice. Spent it with wifey. Uh, watched Netflix and chilled. Actually, we watched Midway on HBO. That was really good. Um, very good uh, Michael Bay type movie. Roland Emmerich, who's like a Michael Bay. Just big budget kind of Independence Day kind of stuff. But it was really good. It was really enjoyable. Uh, the actors were great. Uh, now we're going to get to some reading. And at the way things are going to be going now, I'm going to be skipping over a bunch because many of these actually aren't the best things that anybody ever said. Some of them actually aren't even great things. So I am skipping some. And um, that's, uh, that's uh, using some feedback that I got from some of you folks. So I'm going to skip a few and start moving on faster. And also, you guys may notice that I moved the mic up here. Um, that's because, uh, the mic that was, when it was sitting down here, it was resonating all this little banging noises. So I'm kind of working on this. This has a little like, elastic kind of soundproof system. So I'm going to use this. Alrighty. Now we're going straight to 521, which was said by Ted Morgan. Howard Hughes was able to afford the luxury of madness. Like a man who not only thinks he is Napoleon, but hires an army to prove it. <claps> hires an army to prove it. 522. Lord Falkland. Of the islands, maybe? Don't know. When it is not necessary to make a decision, it is necessary not to make a decision. I can kind of go with him on that. That's pretty good. Um... 524, Moses Hadass in a letter. Thank you for sending me a copy of your book. I'll waste no time reading it. <laughs> I think it was a letter to the guy who wrote this book. <laughs> All right, 525, Franklin P. Adams. There are plenty of good five-cent cigars in the country. The trouble is they cost a quarter. What this country really needs is a good five-cent nickel. Man, last time I saw a nickel, wasn't even worth a penny. I think that's what we need. We need more nickels in this world that are worth five cents. <laughs> oh, man, I'm feeling a little silly today. I hope everything's gone with you guys. I'm going to uh, split, let you guys off early, and uh, I'll see you tomorrow. I love every single one of you. Have a nice day. And again, smile and make someone else smile. All right? Love you. Boom.